Digging deep standing strong soldier piles in construction. We've all seen construction sites, giant holes in the ground where impressive buildings will eventually stand. But have you ever stopped to think about how those massive excavations stay safe and prevent collapses? That's where soldier piles come in, the unsung heroes of excavation support. These sturdy vertical beams, driven deep into the earth, act like guardians, holding back the surrounding soil and ensuring the safety of everyone working within the excavation. They are the backbone of safe and efficient excavation, allowing us to build bigger, better and deeper than ever before. What exactly are soldier piles? Imagine a line of strong soldiers standing at attention shoulder to shoulder, protecting a fortress. That's what soldier piles do, but instead of protecting a fortress, they protect construction sites. They are vertical beams made of steel, concrete or sometimes wood, driven deep into the ground before excavation begins. These sturdy supports act as retaining walls, preventing the surrounding soil from collapsing into the excavated area. Think of them as temporary but critical fortifications, ensuring the stability of the excavation and the safety of the workers and surrounding structures. How do soldier piles work? A symphony of strength. Soldier piles don't work alone. They are installed in a specific pattern along the excavation perimeter, spaced a few feet apart, depending on the project requirements. Once in place, they work in conjunction with lagging horizontal supports that span the gap between the piles. Lagging, typically made of steel plates or wooden planks, is inserted behind the flanges of the soldier piles, creating a continuous wall that effectively holds back the surrounding earth. This robust system ensures the excavated area remains stable throughout the construction process. Section 4. Installing Soldier Piles – A Step-by-Step -step Guide Installing soldier piles is a well-defined process that requires specialised equipment and skilled operators. Here's a simplified breakdown. First, a large drill rig bores holes into the ground at predetermined locations along the excavation perimeter. These holes are slightly larger than the diameter of the soldier piles. Next, the soldier piles typically made of steel H-beams, are lowered into the drilled holes. The space between the pile and the surrounding soil is then filled with grout, a high-strength concrete mixture. This grout sets and hardens, firmly anchoring the soldier pile in place. Once the grout has cured, lagging is inserted behind the flanges of the soldier piles, spanning the gap between them. This creates the continuous retaining wall that supports the excavation. Section 5. The Advantages of Soldier Piles, Strength, Speed and Savings Soldier piles offer numerous advantages over other excavation support methods, making them a popular choice for a wide range of projects. Soldier piles are often a more cost-effective solution compared to traditional retaining walls, especially for deep excavations. Their relatively quick installation and minimal material requirements contribute to overall cost savings. The installation process for soldier piles is typically faster than other methods, reducing construction time and associated costs. This speed is particularly beneficial in urban environments where minimising disruption is crucial. Soldier piles can be used in various soil conditions and excavation depths, making them a versatile solution for diverse construction projects. They can also accommodate different shapes and sizes of excavations, providing flexibility in design. Section 6. Soldier piles in action from city streets to mountain roads. The applications of soldier piles are vast and varied, proving their versatility and importance in modern construction. Here are a few examples. In densely populated cities, soldier piles are indispensable for creating safe excavations for underground parking garages, subway stations and building foundations. Their ability to work in tight spaces and minimise disturbance to surrounding structures makes them ideal for urban projects. When widening roads or building overpasses, soldier piles are used to support the excavations required for bridge abutments and retaining walls. Their strength and reliability ensure the stability of these critical infrastructure components. 
Soldier piles are also used in slope stabilization projects to prevent landslides and erosion. By anchoring unstable slopes, they enhance safety and protect property. Section 7, a salute to soldier piles, unsung heroes of construction. The next time you walk by a construction site, take a moment to appreciate the soldier piles silently standing guard. These unassuming yet essential elements play a vital role in shaping our built environment. They allow us to dig deeper, build higher and create the structures that define our modern world. So, let's give a salute to the soldier piles, the unsung heroes of construction, ensuring safety and enabling progress one excavation at a time.